rotted or decayed. The hamburger itself, the bread has never molded, the meat has never rotted. So this happened for the same reason that these dried berries won't grow mold on them, but fresh berries can grow mold on them. Dehydration is one of the oldest preservation methods, and all that happened is that these food items simply just dried out. The moisture was reduced, the water activity was reduced, and under a certain water activity, yeast mold and bacteria cannot grow. So those fries essentially turned into potato chips, the bun essentially turned into a crouton, and the burger essentially turned into beef jerky. This same thing can happen with a homemade burger. They actually did it on Serious Eats. They did some fast food burgers, they made a homemade burger, and as long as it is thin enough to dry out before it grows mold on it, once it gets low enough water activity, it's not going to grow mold on it. So. That's exactly what can happen. That's exactly how jerky is made. Water is removed, so the water activity is reduced, so yeast mold and bacteria can't grow in it. Now that's certainly not to say that these food items are okay to eat. Yes, it is true there is no visible mold on them, but there are other spoilage factors such as rancid oil, uh, so I wouldn't recommend eating these items. They are spoiled in other ways, even though you can't see mold on them.